Snap, here we are. I'm gonna do a brake delete. I'm gonna cut this thing off. And we're gonna stop stopping, right? <laughs> Pretty much. Cool. Well, you don't see very many videos on how to take it apart and whatnot. You just see how many people replace them. We're gonna figure it out. We're gonna, just gonna going. cut the whole thing off pretty much. Got the axle pad on here now, but gonna have to take all this off, unscrew all this BS, and we're gonna trim her down to where it's an axle delete or brake delete. Axle delete. We don't go anywhere. <laughs> That's not good. All right, no. let's get it. <laughs> all right, we got these two things off the spacer and the paddle. Gotta take the hub off, and then we gotta take these two out of here, and then it's already leaking. Look at that, full water. Look at this rock. Like a mother trucker. <laughs> like a mother trucker. Come on. And uh, let's get it. Taking it off is the easy part once you get into it a few times. Damn, she's rolling around. Yeah, you gotta make sure there's a little tension on her. The Using pipe. the right tools for the job. Yeah, we're on the pipe job right now. <laughs> Someone's gonna be in the comments upset about that. Yeah, you ain't kidding. There's always someone sitting on the couch eating Cheetos. <laughs> <laughs> Oh, man. Hey. Slide right out. Bam. Just like that. A little spacer. Ring in there. And a ring? Something like that. Pretty sure these are 10 mil. No. Eight? Nine. Oh, damn. Yeah, so you got to take all those off. And then, yeah, so then the, whole, like the whole case should slide off. Yeah. We won't bore you guys with that. We'll just, uh, we'll take these out. Hang on. Change your, uh, Jesus. rear brake water. water. <laughs> Alright. Change the water out. And the goldfish in there. Use a squirter. Yeah. Oh now my this god. That looks terrible. Junk. Alright, guys. Smell that? Smells good. I like the smell of that. Success. Damn, she owned there. Stick your fingers in there, boy. We'll be back in a second. <laughs> yeah, you See, that's. You had to use a flathead prior off. Look at that, though. Is this. Alright, he's taking the bolts off the back side there. I'm gonna take it off to cut it. Because, uh. There's really no way to cut it on the machine like that. Nah, it's just messed up. Can't do that, man. Can't do it, man. Oh, snap. Use a rubber mallet. Remember that, fellas. Ooh. Damn. Change your Into water. So you gotta keep her on there because she got the bearings inside. Oh, yeah. Yeah, yeah you got it. All right. We were trying to figure it out. You definitely got to keep right. this on there, but you got to cut it. So they don't make delete kits for these bikes. And I don't think they came into them until the ranchers. I've asked around about it, but nope, nothing. But I've seen people, they cut perfect around here because it bolts right back up to the swing arm. Yeah, that seal. And you seal. have to have the bearings in there because, I mean, obviously. That seal, too, is probably yeah, important. Yeah, a pretty good bearing. <laughs> don't mess up that seal on there. Yeah. You know what would be sick, man, is if you could ride that line all the way around. Almost out. I just wasted half the right there. I got my steel toe crocs on. We're up here on this wooden concrete block here. Wooden concrete you know what I'm block. Saying? Wooden concrete block. <laughs> Hate them. Honestly, it'd probably be, good. be smarter to go over there on that. <laughs> Greater. Yeah. <laughs> cool. Guys, always wear your crocs. Pretty much these things. The gasket. Which one? That's on this side. That shit don't matter. Oh yeah, forget that piece. Here, take that. Ooh, a little worm. Just snake. <laughs> <in the heek. laughs> get the milk cocky. This get is gonna be time. We're gonna be here for a while, yeah. <laughs>
All right, we got the flathead jammed her off. Cole Swole's gonna get her done. All right, Cole Swole <laughs> went to town on her. That's pretty, how, pretty much how you do it. <laughs> Besides that. Yeah, you don't want to do that. <laughs> I wasn't paying attention. I kind of cut a little too close to it, but it was. Still hold up, though. Have you put some O-ring? Some type of. Uh, supposed to go straight in there. Yeah. But. Some kind of gasket, waterproof gasket on here. We'll do something. Right. I got some Ultra back. We'll try to stuff oh her up. Oh, my God, there. Ultra back. Hell yeah. yeah. <laughs> They're about to go to town. Put it in your back, you know what I'm saying? <laughs> Come on. on. Family channel. <laughs> All cleaned up. Good enough. Besides this, but. Ultra black hole. Told you, man. Oh, damn. He ain't playing around. Go to Ace one time and don't know how to act, huh? That's right. Cashed out. There you, you got go. me, man. There you got me. Cashed out. Pretty much stuff her in there best we can. How much we can do about it. With some grease here in your spine. I'm greasing your, uh, I'm lubing your shaft here. Thank you. It's not even mine, but I appreciate it. <laughs> Try to cake her up down there. I know people are going to be mad, that, but what can you do, man? Trying our best out here. They don't make them for this bike that I know of. That's how it's gonna go. All right. Get her in the best we can. Maybe. Put her on there the right way. There it is. I mean, because if you're going on it. Do a hole where it's rutted on the right, like real deeper than the left. I feel like that would drag more. Make sure that I'll torque you down. <clears throat> Good enough. Torque the spec. Yep. All right, take a look at her. Put some ultra black right on her. Ultra black all around here because that's where I accidentally cut a little bit more on that seal. But then put another coat on it tomorrow. Yeah. It should toughen her up and then. Yeah, there ain't. We sprayed some WD-40 up in here just to lube it up, make sure it's all good. And it didn't push through; it just fell right back down on the ground. So, once it's all dry with the ultra black, we'll hit it with a. Uh, Looks a hell of a lot cleaner. Yeah, it's already a lot better looking. Figured some people bolt the axle paddle type deal to this to have like a paddle here, paddle here, whatever. They bolted up to it, but. I ain't gonna do none of that nonsense when we have that up there. So I think she'll ride out, hit it with some black spray paint, and she'll Definitely go to town. Did, uh, did another coat on there. Yeah. Of that ultra black. Yep. Let that first coat dry and cake it up some more. But once we get back together and load her up. <laughs> all right. Take a look at her. Got her all done up now. So she looks like from the back. Mm. <laughs> Way cleaner. Let her roll her up a little bit. Definitely got some weight reduction. Oh, yeah. Well, it took about 20. Look at this. Pounds. That's the seat puddle from the water leaking from the seat. <laughs> yeah, man. Definitely looks a lot better. Looks a lot. A lot Once better. That ultra black drives it oh, with yeah. some paint. Hey, but look. Just send it, guys. Just send it. If you don't send it, then mend it. But yeah, that's how she does it. If you don't mend it, then bend it. We'll get her out in the sunlight real quick. Wow, look at that. It already looks 10 times, 10 times better. Gone. For all I know, I'm the first person to do it on video because I've looked up tons of videos on how to do it, but I haven't seen anyone do it on 300 yet. So I'll take this in consideration. First, brake delete on a 300. Not 100% sure, but if you guys know anything or have any suggestions, let me know on what else we should do. But hey, 
that's it on the 300 just did an oil change again because she had some milk in her but she's a water bike who cares but yeah we got the axle paddle on her now and uh yeah she's a ripper got the go-kart video's gonna be out today tomorrow Maybe. tomorrow it's all gonna be out tomorrow. sunday oh snap oh, potty mouth again <laughs> all right i'm gonna send her off now 300 is done for now you guys wouldn't believe it i ain't got no pipe on there <laughs> but that's it for now break the lead on the 300 thanks for watching